Right now, the Marine vet who spent several months in a Tijuana prison is in trouble again. Ted News military reporter Hannah Mullins is live in our newsroom. So what was the arrest this time for? Guys, deputies arrested him for just a small amount of pot. This right here is his newest mugshot, but it's not his first. The man who once served his country is now serving a jail sentence. In 2014, Andrew Tamarisi made international headlines. He claimed he missed the final U-turn at the San Ysidro port of entry and accidentally drove into Mexico. He had three loaded weapons and a lot of ammo in his truck. Mexican authorities tossed him in jail where we heard from him during the ordeal. I was nervous, you know, because I was missing my family and uh, the people in there, they started messing with me. It terrified his mom. He says, Mom, I'm in here with a whole lot of hitmen who have told me that they're going to kill me. They're going to rape, torture and murder me. Coast to coast rallies and high profile politicians called for his release. This is an abomination. TV star Montel Williams months. took the Don't case to Capitol President Hill. Obama. Several uncertain months went by. Then Mexico freed him since they couldn't treat his PTSD. This experience for him in the last seven months is in a lot of ways has re-traumatized him. And sure enough, five months later, cops cuffed him in Georgia and accused him of drunk driving. His attorney said he was still battling his PTSD. Now he's serving a month in jail. He reportedly admitted to the pot charges and could spend one month in jail. Hannah Mullins, 10 News.